Oh, yes. Every year, did you know more than 90,000 children are treated at UNM's at Children's Hospital, many for serious injuries and some who are seriously sick. Being stuck in a hospital is not fun for anyone, particularly kids, but there is a way to lift their spirits. You can help. You donate a toy and contribute to Superhero Day. It is coming up this Friday, and you still have time to get involved. To find out more on that, Catwoman is here, Diana Vendraska. Good morning, Diana. It's good to see you. Good morning. How uh, are you? I'm great, thank you. And you? I'm awesome. Okay, so you are all ready for Superhero Day. I'm so excited. Yes, I okay. am ready. Okay, so what can we do to get ready for Superhero Day to help you and UNM Children's Hospital out? Well, a lot of these children in, are in the hospital for a very, very, very long time, and they get really, really bored. So what I'd like is for people to come out and bring them toys, yeah. give them something new and fun to do. Uh-huh. Okay, so from now until the end of the week, you're collecting toys for kids of all ages? Yes. From infants to teenagers, you could go to any New Mexico bank and trust right now. Okay. And on October 31st, you could come by UNM Hospital and drop off a toy, meet the superheroes. Okay. And we have a room reserved for the children, so they'll be able to look down and see everybody wave at them. Wow. It's gonna be fun. That's awesome. Yeah. Now, last year it looked like we had some video of uh, some superheroes hanging around outside the building. Yes. That was pretty great. How did you get, here we go, we have uh, Spider-Man, and is that the Incredible Hulk? Yes, it is. How did you get those two to make a stop at UNM's uh, Children's Hospital? Well, luckily, um, I called Tuck's Window Company, and they were all into this. I told oh, them, you know what, awesome. can you get your window washers to dress the superheroes? And he said, absolutely. And these two guys are amazing. That amazing. is great. So are they going to be back this year? They will be back, yes. Okay, and the yeah. children don't know this. They do not. They do not. They do not. So, Total so, surprise. Okay, so they're just going to go up upstairs there, and they don't. They're not going to have a clue as to what's going on with right. the toys, with the superheroes, with anything. Right. They just have a room reserved for them, and they get to uh, total surprise. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. How long have you been doing this? This is my second year. Okay. I'm going to do it forever and ever, though. Why? These kids, if you could just see the look on their face. Oh my gosh, last year we walked around and we greeted them and they were just in total awe. Uh -huh. I'm a volunteer there, so the following week I got to visit with them and say, hey, I heard superheroes were here and they were yeah. just like, oh my gosh, they couldn't say enough about the superheroes. Is it, it kind of makes them forget where they are and what they're going yes. through for even just a day. Yes, Okay. Yes. but it's so. all about. Yeah, all about the kids. You want to find out more about Superhero Day, head to our website at krqe.com. You're going to be back. I will be the back. The real Diana is going to be back, yes. not Catwoman <laughs> Diana. In just a minute, we're going to talk more about this and tell people again how they can get involved and exactly what this means and also talking about who else is involved because this is a very big undertaking yes. that you've created, but it's a great project. Yes, it is. Okay, stick around. We'll be right back here on KRQE this morning.